Hello, thanks for watching WCCO, also streaming now on CBSN Minnesota. Itching to get out of the house this weekend? Three weeks into the stay at home order, the governor says Minnesota golf courses, bait shops, and marinas can reopen tomorrow. The new rules let folks enjoy outdoor activities at a safe distance, of course. WCCL's Mariel Moe shows us how businesses spent the night getting ready to welcome back customers. So we started here this morning at 8 o'clock, and we probably have a dozen to uh, 13, 14 big boats in. A busy day for the crew at North Shore Marina on Lake Minnetonka. Owner Richie Anderson is relieved they got the go-ahead from Governor Tim Walls to get their marina open and operating again. I think the time has come and the governor made a great call. Anderson's goal is to get about 20 boats in the water each day during the weekend, then begin summarizing them so owners can take them out as soon as possible. Families, which normally always use the boats, it's a great solace for them. It's a great way to social distance. The executive order also allows golf courses and driving ranges to reopen as long as golfers continue to practice social distancing, which shouldn't be too hard across an 18 hole course. The fact that it's it's got to be done outside and people can and you know kind of keep their their distance and keep space between them. Zach Hallberg lives across the street from Brookview Golf Course in Golden Valley. He's excited to have golf as a new excuse to get out of the house. Get some fresh air and kind of shake things up. Campground outdoor retail stores, equipment rental, charter boat rides, and guided fishing remain closed. But to see some things reopen shows progress. It feels good and, and it feels like we're moving in the right direction. On Lake Minnetonka, Mary Elmo's WCCO 4 News. The governor says Minnesota is moving in the right direction to begin opening even more businesses, but it won't all happen at once.